sometimes. Sometimes I think about the Penningtons, and I wonder if they're okay. I wonder if that's still the place in Wailuku where missionaries stay. You used to be able to hear them fighting, but I guess that's what old people do. Once your children grow up, the only person you can pick a fight with is sitting across from you. I don't blame them. I guess it's human nature. We look for confrontation instead of working on improved self-behavior. The Warners asked me to put my life on delay. I didn't know them before 2013, but I wanted their approval anyway. I used to babysit for them, at least that's what I was told. To tell an 18-year-old something like that was maybe dangerous and irresponsible. I was told it'd be the best two years, and I'd think about it every day. Only one of those were true, but in a much different way. I still feel guilt and shame, even though I did nothing wrong. My brain started to misfire, but I guess that was the plan all along. I suffered so much, all in the name of grace. But none was left for me, I heard from your actions and from some of your face. I did everything I was supposed to, and it was somehow a sin. If anyone asks why I quit, I'll have plenty of reasons. 